Polaris's core objectives are to make the buying experience and user experience of our products easier for our consumers. We do this with the tools that we provide them on the front end of, of whether it's choosing the product, providing the product, and how we test and validate the product. We need tools that allow our employees to collaborate effectively together, ultimately towards the goals of Polaris, our riders, and our dealers. Part of that is making sure that internally we have the processes, the communications, and frankly the data in place to allow our employees to design and introduce new products. CAD and PLM is a very critical step in this digital transformation. It is basically the hub in which everything else kind of stimulates off of. We have to be able to basically modify our process to adapt to the tools that we are able to use now and basically drive that into our processes and change even some of our standards and the way they're written. Being able to know which part is the correct part for your vehicle. Being able to see and visualize publications digitally and online and in real time. We're using that information from PTC to also help us handing off vehicles from design through engineering and product development into the manufacturing space. We feel that these new tools and this new approach with PTC with, a, with CAD connected to an E-bomb or an M-bomb and then passed on to a service bomb and then having that flow out to parts lists and illustrations, we feel that the automation that comes along with that and the streamlining of the process, the way we can change our processes based on that is truly going to allow us to get to the next level with all of these objectives. We are very limber and we want to move fast and adjust to the market quickly. Being able to take our module structure configure it in multiple different options, right, and say, how do I get this new recipe very, very quickly? So our pursuit of options and variants module inside of the windshield set basically is driven by our customer need to personalize the vehicles or even our dealership's ability to basically customize a vehicle for their market so they're not competing against the dealer directly down the road. And these tools that we're creating and implementing throughout the set from our module structure to our service tools, to our work instructions, to our configurator tools, all of this should enable that extra connection to the consumer and making that vehicle specific to them using options and variants. Today my small teams are uh, keeping up with the pace of new products coming down the pipe. We're getting by, we're able to meet our deadlines, but as we look ahead to options and variants and all the different choices that customers and dealers are going to have with these vehicles. It's almost like an explosion of models that would be very difficult for us to keep up with without these advanced tools from PTC. Ultimately, for our customers, for our riders, they're going to be able to have the vehicle that's right for them. The vehicle that's the right features, the right capabilities, that has the correct accessories for their experiences. We use PTC tools not only to help us design the vehicle itself, but it also helps us do the right thing for our customers throughout the entire customer journey.